Highway Patrol, I attended class at Gordon Cooper, never thinking I'd be president of the school board. It's a privilege to be involved with Gordon Cooper in any way. It doesn't make any difference what you do. There is a culture that exists here I don't believe exists anywhere else. We're connected with the community, the leaders, each and every person has a vote in what we do. We're proud to serve and we're proud to be a part of this accomplishment. As a state trooper, I always knew that there were three things that you needed in an accident. You needed a police officer of some type, you needed a fireman to dig the victims out, and you needed EMTs to get them to the hospital and save their lives. So when you see this structure going up, remember they may be the ones that may save you your life or a loved one's life at some point. And I knew when on the patrol at that time, they did not have the training or equipment. You can buy equipment all day long. If the person is not trained to use it, it has no value. And at a scene, whether it's a fire, an accident of any kind, or a disaster, moments mean the difference between life and death. And with this facility, our local departments, local fire departments, EMTs, won't have to go to Oklahoma City and lose valuable time on their job or add extra cost to their department to get the training that they need. A lot of our fire departments are volunteers. They barely survive. If we can provide a place for them to train and gain additional training, hopefully that will make the job safer for them and safer for the ones that we protect. But we're very privileged to have this facility going up. It serves this entire area. It's not just for one place. It's for everybody.